One of the questions that people often ask me, which I think is a deeply important one, is, is how would we feel if we knew scientifically, once and for all, that there actually was a greater spiritual reality, that spirit existed, and that spirit could play an important role in our individual and collective lives. The purpose of this book is to really raise those questions and show, in fact, which is what the title of the book, The Sacred Promise, means, that science can actually give us an answer, and the answer appears to be yes. The word spirit is a somewhat controversial word um, because it has different meanings. When I use the word spirit, I'm using it in this way that famous mediums such as John Hibbert and Mary Ocino mean it. When they mean by spirit is they mean energy. And you know, Einstein said that E equals MC squared, that energy cannot be created or destroyed. At best what's happened is it's transformed. It continues like the light from distant stars. So spirit refers to any kind of energy, any kind of energy and information, and we all, quote, have it. Well, I wrote the book first and foremost because the evidence was pointing me in this direction. But why now is because we are at a precipice in terms of our lives on this planet. We are facing greater challenges than maybe at any time in our species history. We can't wait another 20 years or another 30 years to awaken to this possibility if there's an opportunity for us to get a clear answer. It's a consciousness raising book about how science and spirituality can come together and directly affect our personal lives. If we in fact live in a spirit full universe, in a universe that's filled with opportunity for guidance and the like, then there's a great possibility for us to maybe solve the problems collectively between here and there that we couldn't address individually. And I share this as a scientist. Thank you.